Hello everyone and welcome back to The Breakdown. Today I'm going to be teaching you how to download and install Minecraft 1.15.2. Minecraft 1.15.2 just came out today. The day I'm recording this video, about three hours ago or so, it came out. And here we are doing a video on how you can download and install it. If that's not pretty fast, I don't know what is. For example, if you wanted Optifine for Minecraft 1.15.2, we'll drop a video the day it comes out on how to get Optifine so you can subscribe to the channel for that. But today we're going to be going over everything you need to know to get Minecraft 1.15.2 installed. We are going to be using the default Minecraft launcher here. Now I'm going to assume you've already got this launcher and go into the tutorial assuming you have that and then later on in the tutorial I'm going to show you how to get it if you don't have it already because you know it is something that I would recommend having. Like I would recommend having this default Minecraft launcher. It's really really good now. They've updated it. It's great. So why wouldn't you use it? And that's what, you know, I'm going to show you later in the tutorial. But I'm assuming you already have it, because most people do. And it's just easier to skip right on into that point. First of all, though, we do have a most of our sponsor, which is Apex Minecraft Hosting. Go to the first link down below of the breakdown.xyz slash Apex. Get an incredible 24-hour DNOS protected Minecraft server for you and your friends. We actually have Apex so much that we host our own server, play.breakdowncraft.com on them. So again, if you were looking for a great Minecraft server for your friends and family to love, enjoy, and play on all natively in Minecraft 1.15.2, Apex Minecraft Hosting is the simplest, easiest, and just overall best way to do it. So check out Apex Minecraft Hosting at the first link down below the breakdown.xyz slash Apex. Nevertheless, let's go ahead and get this set up. Let's download, install, get Minecraft 1.15.2 running. So here we are in the default Minecraft launcher. Now, what you want to do is go ahead and click on this little arrow to the left of that green play button here. Yours may say something different than mine, and that's okay. Just click on that, and then click on latest release 1.15.2. Once you click on that, you can click play. However, however, if um, if you don't have that, let's say the latest release now says 1.15.7 or it says 1.16, whatever it says, it's not 1.15.2 under latest release. What do you do? How do you play an older Minecraft version if it's not the most recent version? Well, let me show you. What you want to do is click on the installations tab up here at the top of the screen. See that installations tab? Go ahead and click on that. Now, in here, I have a bunch of stuff. You might not have anything. You might just have latest release and latest snapshot, and you might not even have that. You might just have latest release, but that's fine. What you want to do is click on this plus new button right here. Now, for the name of this, you can name it whatever you want. I'm going to name it play.breakdowncraft.com. Well, I'm going to name it that because that is our own incredible network Minecraft server. We have two 1.15 survival servers with aquatic survival and medieval survival. They are absolutely incredible. We also have custom skyblock with OP enchants and just a ton of awesome stuff. So come play with us. Play.breakdowncraft.com is the IP if you want incredible skyblock or survival gameplay. We also have factions coming soon. It's going to be You're going to love our faction server. So subscribe to our Discord, which is in the description down below for more information on that. But nevertheless, under version here, what you want to do is click on this drop down box. And then what you want to find is release 1.15.2. Now, obviously it just came out, so it's first. However, if you're watching this, like I said, a year from now, and it's not the most latest release anymore, you want to scroll down until you do find it farther down the page there. So for me, it's release 1.15.2 right there. That's what it'll be for you as well. When you find that, click on it and you're done. I'm going to change my resolution here just so you all can see once we get in game. But at this point, we can go ahead and click create. Then we have this new play .break breakdowncraft.com profile down here. Click on that green play button next to it and it's going to launch up Minecraft in 1.15.2 without any issues whatsoever. It's going to automatically download everything that you need. It's going to set it all up. It's going to do everything for you. It's just click the play button. It, it does everything else. I don't know what I'm even saying anymore. Just stutter. I, I never stutter. In these. What was that? Anyway, here we are. We are on the Minecraft main menu. We can see down here in the bottom left, Minecraft 1.15.2 is selected. So that is how you can set up Minecraft and download and install Minecraft 1.15.2 if you've already got the launcher. But what if you don't have the launcher? What if you do and you clicked play and it just aired, it doesn't work, it crashes, all of that stuff? Well, I'm going to give you tips on all that right now. First and foremost, what if you don't have the launcher? Well, we have an in-depth tutorial on how to download and install Minecraft on PC, and this will get you that Minecraft launcher that we will we were using. It goes through all of it here, download the launcher, setting it up, all that is here. So go through this tutorial to get the new Minecraft launcher set up and running. This tutorial is also on the new Minecraft launcher, so all of that stuff. However, what if you had the launcher, you still click launch, it didn't work, it crashed, maybe it went white screen and then said program not responding. Well, if it went program not responding, simple. Just close out of Minecraft, open up the Minecraft launcher again, 
and then click play again, right? So if it just went white screen, it started not working, just try to launch Minecraft 1.15.2 again, and that'll probably work. But if it doesn't work, no worries, we have a solution for you. So the first step that you wanna do is actually allocate and add more RAM to Minecraft. So here's our in-depth tutorial on how to add more RAM to Minecraft 1.15. It is in the description down below. It will help you add more RAM, get everything set up. As you can see, it is a seven and a half minute video. I'm not covering it in this video because this, I mean, it's, it's an entire process to do it correctly and to make sure you don't add more RAM than your computer has. Now, also in that video, we do cover Java. And if you are having issues launching Minecraft, it could be a good idea, and is a good idea, to go into the description down below and download the correct version of Java for Minecraft. As you can see, it specifically says mods and servers here, but it also is needed for normal Minecraft. So come in here, download it, install it, all that stuff. And then if you are having issues after that, you could try to run the jar fix. However, that's not something I've noticed to help Minecraft launch as much. Usually that's gonna just be installing Java or allocating more RAM. But yeah, those are going to be your biggest issues and biggest things there that can typically cause Minecraft to not launch or have issues or something like that. So once you've done that, you should again just be able to come in here and click that play button. If you're you know under latest release, same thing, just click that play button and it's gonna open up Minecraft 1.15.2. That's how simple, that's how easy it is. It's really not a complicated process whatsoever. It just works and that's what I love about this you know minecraft launcher and how my mojang has set it up these days it just works you don't really have to worry about it and 1.15.2 actually did fix a launch bug that would lock up launch or lock up minecraft during launch that no longer exists so that chance of that white screen issue that i was talking about where you just have to close out of minecraft and relaunch it um chances of that are even reduced now as well so awesome stuff there thank you all so so much for watching i hope you enjoyed this video and i can't wait for you to join us on play.breakdowncraft.com that is an incredible grief protected survival server we've got awesome medieval survival with over 30 custom quests and a player-based economy we have aquatic survival with a slash shop based economy, MCMO, and tons of awesome stuff over there. And then we do have custom Skyblock with OP enchants, custom islands, and factions coming soon. So awesome stuff there. Come play with us on play.breakdowncraft.com, the best Minecraft server in the multiverse. Nevertheless, if this video did help you out, give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel for more awesome content every single day of the week. My name is Nick. This has been The Breakdown, and I am out. Peace.